At first, I felt negotiation is really hard. Before joining CCHN, I used to negotiate based on instincts. Before CCHN, I was alone. Ten years ago, humanitarians negotiating for assistance and protection didn't have a structured approach or a community supporting them. But they knew that a failed negotiation could prevent thousands from getting the assistance they needed. So, they wanted to create a method that could help them and others facing the same challenges. This is the story of the Naivasha grid. In 2014, a group of senior humanitarian leaders met in the village of Naivasha in Kenya to reflect on their negotiation experiences and identify common approaches. Analyzing the practices of hundreds of humanitarians, they created a conceptual framework to plan, carry out, and evaluate any humanitarian negotiation. For the first time, humanitarians had a common language to talk about their shared dilemmas. More importantly, they were building a community of professionals who could learn together and support each other. The Naivasha Grid was born. When I joined TCHN family, I felt more confident. Now I've learned a lot of experiences from colleagues and a lot of techniques and tools that make me much more efficient. After CCHN, I have a family, a community that I can relate to and overcome all my challenges. The International Committee of the Red Cross, Maison Sans Frontières, United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees, and the World Food Programme understood the importance of building negotiation skills across the humanitarian sector. With the support of the Swiss government, they came together to create the Center of Competence on Humanitarian Negotiation in 2016. For the past eight years, frontline humanitarians have been receiving support and guidance through a growing network of expert negotiators. Year after year, the CCHN community has established itself as a global center of expertise with almost 8,000 humanitarians becoming stronger negotiators and creating positive change every day. In 2024, we're meeting once again to reflect together on today's negotiation challenges capitalize on our collective knowledge and celebrate the CCHN community of practice.